We do have some breaking news to report concerning news. That is that Senate Minority Leader Mitch McConnell, pictured there, just appeared to freeze during his weekly press conference about halfway through a sentence as he was speaking. Armando Raju was in the room as this happened. And Mano, I wonder if you could describe what you saw and what you're hearing now from McConnell's office. Yeah, Mitch McConnell, this is every week. They, he gives a weekly press conference, talks to reporters about the issues of the day. And he began his remarks, his opening remarks, talking about the legislative business that is happening in the United States Senate. Then he abruptly froze, causing some uh, questions, some alarm among some of his colleagues, and the suggestion that perhaps they should end the press conference hastily. And he later went back to his office for some time, then returned to answer some questions ultimately said he was fine, but this is the moment in which he froze in the middle of his opening remarks. After finishing the NDA uh, this week, it's been good bipartisan cooperation and a string of Say, or should I just go back to your office? Do you want to say anything else to the press? Let's go back to you. Go ahead, John. Now, those initial, the senator who was initially speaking to him was Senator John Barrasso, who is a physician, asked him sure. if he was okay and mm -hmm. want to continue on with that press conference. Uh, recall there has been a number of concerns about Senator McConnell's health. He is 81 years old. Earlier this year, he suffered a fall, hit his head while at an event at a Washington hotel. He was later hospitalized for some time. Uh, he was diagnosed with a concussion as well as some broken ribs. He's had some walking issues for m much of his life, given that he had pulled Polio is a child that he later recovered from and then has has had some incidents as of in recent years of tripping and falling, including earlier this year in that one incident. So I asked the leader whether or not this was related to that concussion that he suffered mm -hmm. earlier this year. He said, no, I am fine. He did not elaborate at all. But he did continue the press conference, did answer some questions, including about impeachment, the talk about potentially impeaching Joe Biden in the U.S. House, as well as the plea deal with Hunter Biden that collapsed, as well as some other discussions, questions about the appropriations process and spending legislation that's happening. So he was able to answer some of those questions. But in just observing McConnell in recent yeah. weeks, uh, he's, he's been a little bit, uh, he's speaking much slower. He's not as speaking as, mm. uh, he's in recent press conferences, he's been speaking with more of a hushed tone, not as uh, uh, loud of a voice as he has had uh, in the past. Uh, at one point earlier this year, just a few weeks ago, he was unable to hear questions uh, that were being asked to him that were clearly audible among some of the reporters who were asking yeah. at his weekly press conference. So here, obviously, a concerning situation. But as you can hear there, Jim, the leader says he's fine, and he's, he said he can do his job. Well, deeply yeah. concerning, that pause, as you saw it on camera there, lasted an uncomfortable length of time. As you mentioned, Senator John Barrasso, an MD himself, but do we know if the minority leader received any medical attention following this? I, it doesn't seem that way, Jimmy. It was pretty quick from the time he left the press conference from the time that he returned to answer questions. Each of those senators who were pictured there with him were answering or giving their own opening statements before the leader came back to answer about five questions or so from reporters. So it, there was not any time to get any sort of medical, uh, medical, uh, re uh, right. any doctor or anyone to come and diagnose him with anything uh, here. But it's very clear that uh, that obviously uh, some this this could potentially be related to all of the after effects right. of that concussion earlier this year. Uh, but the senator says he's fine, even as a number of senators that are obviously concerned about uh, that uh, unusual moment here in the halls of the sure. Senate.